You just arrived at an outreach session where you will be administering Hep B, a free sensitive vaccine. You open your vaccine carrier to find this reading on your freeze indicator. Would you feel confident giving children these vaccines? Anytime a vaccine is being transported or stored at your health facility, it must be kept at the right temperature, between 2 and 8 degrees Celsius. This is especially important for freeze-sensitive vaccines. For these vaccines, freezing is a much greater danger than temporary heat exposure. Freezing is the most common cause of vaccine damage. Electronic freeze indicators help ensure these vaccines are protected. These small digital devices are placed with freeze-sensitive vaccines during transport or storage. They indicate whether vaccines have been exposed to freezing temperatures. An electronic freeze indicator has a visual indicator that shows whether the vaccine has been exposed to freezing temperatures. A check mark shows that the temperatures are OK. If it shows an X, the device has been exposed to a temperature of negative 0.5 degrees Celsius or below for more than 60 minutes. The X signifies an alarm. This alarm should trigger a shake test to determine if the vaccine has been damaged. If so, the vaccine should be discarded. The device can be used until the built-in battery expires. However, the alarm on these devices is irreversible, so once an alarm is triggered, the device cannot be used again. It should be discarded and replaced immediately with a new one. When will you use electronic freeze indicators? Anytime you pack freeze-sensitive vaccines, an electronic freeze indicator should be placed in each cold box or vaccine carrier. Place the freeze indicator on top of the vaccine, taped to a vaccine carton so it does not move around. And do not place the device in direct contact with conditioned ice packs, cool water packs, or warm water packs. They may also be used in a refrigerator storing freeze-sensitive vaccines. They should be placed on top of the vaccines where they can be easily read. They are not needed in refrigerators where 30 DTI is used since this device detects freezing temperatures. And each time you receive a shipment, you should find an electronic freeze indicator in every container holding freeze-sensitive vaccines. Remember to check the status of each freeze indicator as soon as a shipment arrives. After its use, store electronic freeze indicators at room temperature. Then return these devices when the next shipment is collected. You have learned why, how, and when to use electronic freeze indicators. This easy to read device can help you protect freeze sensitive vaccines and make sure children are receiving safe and effective vaccines.